Welcome to Soul Suther, a weekly devotional to guide our life. Today's reading entitled Set the Victims of Violence Free is based on Ruth chapter 3 verses 1 to 13 and chapter 4 verses 13 to 22. I will read verse 5 of chapter 3. I will do whatever you say, Ruth answered. The conversation between Ruth and Naomi, her mother-in-law, symbolizes their powerlessness over the psychological violence they are experiencing. According to the custom at that time, a widow like Ruth would experience financial, material, and life difficulties. Because of this, Naomi told Ruth to ask Boaz for help and protection. Luckily, Boaz knew that Ruth didn't just need protection. She is also a good woman. So Boaz's response was to take care of Ruth. In front of the elders, Boaz tries hard to marry Ruth by purchasing his late husband's estate. Boaz not only ransoms Ruth from the violence she experienced, but frees her so that Ruth becomes a blessing because of the offspring she gave birth to. The value of a life of faith is not only for individual piety. The value of a life of faith calls us to liberate those who are bound by violence. Many children are confined to following their parents' ambitions. Students confined by school rules that do not educate. Many people are harassed by the color of their skin. Workers are insulted by their profession and work. Protection seekers are degraded, and humans are humiliated at birth. They are victims of violence. We are called to lift them up to glory. Come, pray with me. Dear God, we pray that you will protect those who experience violence, whether physical, mental, verbal, or psychological. Amen. If you feel blessed through this devotional, please share it with your friends. And don't forget to subscribe to this channel to receive blessings every day. God bless you. Mari dukung pelayanan dan pekabaran Injil melalui YKB Dengan membagikan link acara ini kepada sebanyak mungkin orang Dukungan juga dapat saudara lakukan dengan mentransfer dukungan finansial ke rekening BCA Ke nomor 450-305-2990 450-305-2990 Atas nama Yayasan Komunikasi Bersama